Ronald Reagan Boulevard and FM 2338. That's despite safety improvements installed last year. KXAN's Lauren Kravitz shows us what TxDOT is doing to make this two-way stop safer. It's like opening a new wound all the time. Every time Lorena McCafferty returns to this spot. Such a strong, life, larger than life person. David, Lorena's husband of 23 years, was hit and killed by a driver last June. The car that crashed into him ran a stop sign on Ronald Reagan Boulevard at Ranch Road 2338. This is the problem. There's a stop sign here at Ronald Reagan Boulevard that not everyone can see, especially coming over this hill behind me. And there is not a stop sign here on 2338, but some cars will try to stop. Williamson County added larger stop signs and flashing lights to try to fix the problem, but crashes continue. TxDOT will now add an overhead flashing beacon on Ronald Reagan and another flashing beacon on 2338 to alert drivers. Always loving life. Lorena believes a traffic light would be the ultimate lifesaver, but this widow will take what she can get. Anything that can prevent another family from having this tragedy. Lauren Kravitz, KXAN News. The speed limits along those roads add to the intensity of the crashes at 65 miles an hour along Ronald Reagan Boulevard for the cars that have to stop at the stop signs and it's 60 miles an hour along 2338. The project to install flashing beacons at the intersection goes out to bid this September. We want to know why a flashing light is being installed there instead of a traffic light. Intersections must meet one of eight minimum standards to qualify for a signal. Engineers study the roads, calculating how many cars cross through the intersection every four and eight hours. They also evaluate how many pedestrians are trying to cross, whether there's a school nearby, and if other traffic control devices like stop signs or flashing lights have failed to prevent crashes. TxDOT tells us engineers studied this intersection, but it did not qualify for a signal. They decided to install the flashing beacon instead to warn drivers that that intersection is coming up.